Today, I'm at an activity centre in Sussex, where our skill seekers are going to be reaching dizzy heights. But first, let's find out who they are. First off the block is Ellie. I'm 11 years old and I love playing badminton. Next up is nine-year-old Mikey. My big passion in life is break dancing. And last but by no means least is Holly. Hello, I'm Holly and I'm 10 years old and I love to play tennis. Let's hope this lot have a good head for heights as they'll be learning how to climb. With over 300 clubs in the UK, climbing is a fantastic adrenaline activity. Today's skill seekers will be getting some expert tuition from Kyle Holman from Hat Adventures. OK, first thing I'm going to show you is bouldering. The idea is that we're going to be doing some rock climbing without any of the ropes and we're going to be doing it nice and low level. Look for your feet, look for your hands, and step up. Excellent, well done. Bouldering Nothing stretches the muscles and is perfect for developing balance and technique. It's very good balance. It's good for your exercise. OK, a big stretch. Brilliant. Carefully place your toe. Did you do much gymnastics at school? Um, a little bit. This is, like, the first time I've ever done rock climbing. I would normally play in the garden with my brother. The next skill I'm going to show you is belaying. Having mastered bouldering, next step is how to safely climb the wall. Belaying is a technique of feeding and controlling a rope used by the climber. As the climber ascends, the belayer or person feeding the rope must remove the slack to keep the rope nice and taut. So if a climber slips, they won't fall to the ground. <gasps> oh, that made you jump, didn't it? Right, attach that on, you know what to do. <laughs> You're under my hand. Yo! Lesson over, it's time to hit the wall and start putting theory into practice. Come on, Holly, Whoa. do it. Oh, 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 oh. OK. And you have to try and grip onto the things, and sometimes you can't grip onto them, and it's really hard. Excellent. Pull down, one, two. Stop climbing so fast. I think we work well as a Good team because we all stuck together and we all work together. Brilliant. Despite all three being new to climbing, a morning of skill seekers' expert tuition is soon paying off. Is it difficult? Yeah. Oh, but you're doing fine. Come on, go for the top. Holly, come on. A sudden finish. Brilliant. Yay! Yay! Okay. Well, when I got here this morning, I looked at it and I was like, I could never get up there, but now I've done it. I feel really proud of myself. If you think this all looks a bit too easy, then come back and join me later when I up the ante and find out exactly what our skill seekers are made of. Ellie, Mikey and Holly have spent the morning learning how to climb. Having mastered this indoor wall, it's time to up the pressure and see exactly what today's skill seekers are made of. Okay, you see this wall, it's a little small. I think you need something a little bigger. Don't look so worried. Come with me. Harrison Rocks is a sheer vertical rock face with over 200 short climbs. At its highest peak, it is 15 times the height of Holly. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Now, your mission today, should you choose to accept it, is to climb to the top of this rock face. That'd be fun. Yeah, Mikey? Yeah. Holly? Oh, you're a bit worried. Don't worry about it. Ellie? Scared, but I'm going to do it. First up is Mikey. Now, remember, none of our skill seekers has ever tackled climbing a rock face before. I'm quite nervous, but I think I'm going to do it. Good one. Nice one. Come on, Mikey. Don't know how I'm going to do this. Come on, Mikey. Mikey, watch your head. That's it, that's it. Go on, Mikey. So Go on, Mikey. Go on, Mikey. That's it, you're doing it. He's made it, he's Woo! made it. Yeah! Well done, Mikey. As Mikey successfully makes it to the summit, the next to try is Ellie. Oh. Go, on, go, on, Ellie. go on, Ellie. Like that, that's it. <laughs> She's doing really, really, really well. Well done, Ellie. 
Brilliant teamwork. <laughs> I think she's going to make it. Okay. Then it'll be two of them done. Looking from down there, I'd never thought I'd make it up here in my entire life. Hooray! 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 Well done! Hooray! Good job! Polly, are you ready? Yeah. OK, then. In your own time, begin. Don't look down. <laughs> the last to go, Holly is the smallest of our skill seekers and therefore has the furthest to reach. Oh, yes. Pat, and then turn, like, pull yourself, yeah, push yeah. yourself up. Lovely. That's it. Keep it there and just try and lift. I've got nowhere to put my hands on. I'm slipping. Halfway up and it looks like the enormity of the climb is too much as Holly shows signs of being forced to give up. going because Ellie kept saying, go on, you can do it, put your mind to it. So I put my mind to it and I, and I actually done it and I really proud. Everybody's made it to the top and completed our Skillicious Challenge. Give us a round of applause. Yeah. Carl, how do you think they did? Oh, I think they did brilliantly. They all got to the top. Brilliant. Beautiful. So give us your verdict. What do you think of climbing? Thumbs up or thumbs down? It's been good today because I've met new friends and they're really nice people. I'm glad that we all made it to the top and we've all completed the challenge. It's one of the best things that I've ever done, I think.